Hello everyone, welcome to Phasmophobia. Today, we're heading into prison on Professional. Before you go in there though, I do want to say, you might notice I sound and look a lot better. With my camera, I learned about a setting, and with my microphone, this whole time I've just been really dumb and bad with this microphone. I've had a hard time figuring out what sounds good, and really, the problem was I've been using noise suppression even though I'm in a totally quiet and really good recording room. So hopefully I should sound good now, but what I want to do is get in there, but I'm still going to talk about the gin that I had on Point Hope. I feel like it's kind of laggy, but no, we're doing good. Look at this sunrise here on prison. Okay, the breaker's over in the cell block A. Now, what cursed item? <laughs> I'm just going to leave that. But I did want to say, as we walked to the breaker, I wanted to talk about this gin. So... I was right, the gin does have an ability where it will drain 25% of your sanity randomly when you're nearby, and when you go back to the truck and look at your sanity, it's kind of like you don't know why your sanity even got drained. So I know Horror 2.0 is something that's coming eventually, but maybe there needs to be like some kind of scare or some kind of notification that you're draining sanity, because it's very weird when you don't get scared and then you just go back to the truck and you're at zero sanity. So, I really, you know, again, Horror 2.0 one day will come here, and I know there's supposed to be hallucinations and stuff, and low sanity stuff, and, you know, it's all a matter of just whenever it gets here. Alright, since we're checking out <laughs> the A block, I wonder if the ghost is going to be in here. Is anyone in here? It's Kevin Shawcross. Where are you? I really hope you're not in here. I think I... Oh. I think I will loop back through on the second floor, but let me stand here. It might be a good idea to <laughs> go outside and loop around to the other cell block. Now I haven't heard anything, I'm going to go ahead and keep walking around. I'm hoping that if I just go to the second floor, maybe I'll run into the ghost. It's always in a cell block though, that's why I kind of want to play prison again. I know I've mentioned that. I'm kind of playing the bigger maps, but I like playing these because I really have not played Prison a lot, and I'm an OG. I was here when Prison first came out, so I remember this map from the beginning. And I'm, Wow, I've not really played Sunrise. I keep seeing the sun coming through all the windows. It looks pretty cool. Is anyone around here? Give us a sign. Now, it really sucks. You should kind of walk around here with a smudge stick if you're just going to be in the dark. I did have the ghost back here one time in my life. That was actually, again, when this map kind of first came out. But if I don't see anything on the floor... Oh god, creepy noises. Hey, look, this is a hiding spot. Oh. I don't know if I'm hearing things. I, I swear I kind of just heard something get thrown. I've never had a... That's my shadow. I've never had a ghost down there in the cafeteria. Alright, I forget this is just like a dead-end area. Well, I swear, maybe I heard something get thrown, but that's probably just me. I'm, I'm thinking it's maybe somewhere near the library, though. I, if I just stay in the dark this long, I'm probably going to go back and get a smudge. I just thought I heard something. I can never tell which way to push these doors. Is anyone in here? And, you know, finding the cold breath is also going to be a good way of finding the room. But guess what? It's sunrise. Is there a hiding spot maybe back here? I guess you could kind of hide here, but it's not really guaranteed. Alright, I'm gonna go look where I thought I maybe heard something. Around the cafeteria and like around the library maybe. Okay, see this is where I get concerned about low sanity. Because I've just been walking around in the dark. I can't tell if I'm hearing my footsteps or what. Here, let me turn the light on in the hallway here. I don't see any doors opened. Can these be- oh, these- oh, <laughs> these are not movable, okay. See, I have not learned a lot on this map. Alright, that, that's the one in here. These are the ones for out in the hallway. You're not in here, are you? Does not look like it. What if you're just like near the entrance? Okay, I'm gonna go check my sanity. Maybe see if the ghost is near the entrance. I'm gonna walk through this other hallway. So this was not <laughs> open, unfortunately. Is anyone around here? Come on. I do, you know, when you play solo on a big map, you kinda 
get a whole new experience. I mean, finding the ghost is half the challenge. Well, I didn't see anything around here. I guess I'm going to drop my stuff at the entrance and then just get more stuff ready to bring in here. Well, I do love how the sunrise looked. I guess I've never really played on here with sunrise. Again, that just goes to show how much I've really not played this map, but uh, they re recently redid the sunrise, so I know it looks a lot better. Okay, sanity looks pretty good, so I guess walking around in the dark on a medium map's not too bad. I guess, I guess I'm going to leave my sanity there. So give me a smudge and then, I don't know, camera and then maybe dots or something. We're going to know. There's that new spirit box. Maybe I'll just bring that in. But I want to go in with a smudge now because I, I'm going to spend more time in the dark. I mean, I could go around with a candle. I'm going to go around with a smudge. We need to drain my sanity to 25% anyway. And I can do that with the music box. But we don't even know where the ghost is yet. All right, I guess I'm dropping this here. I don't even need my tier 3 light. Part of me wants to just go in with this, so that way I'll have all the smudge and the EMF in my headlight. But I don't like walking around in the dark, so... Actually, you know what? I think if I turn on enough lights, let's not run here. We'll be fine. I'm going to turn on the lights as I go into these rooms. Okay, I don't see anything on the floor still. I'm going to check the other cell block. Maybe you're just over here. I didn't really check the uh, sanity or the activity, I mean. Oh, I hear showers. Okay. It just takes enough time and you eventually figure it out. Oh, wait, what? How did, how does that work? It turned off the hallway light. Wow, what? So it didn't turn off the breaker. So is it, yeah, this main lights, it turned off the light all the way over here. Man, big maps are weird. I guess because this is technically the adjacent room's light, it can somehow turn off the lights all the way down here. I don't, I don't understand. It definitely turned off, maybe it did like an event or something. See, this game is confusing me. I'm gonna turn off both lights in the hallway. I don't know, I guess this is all considered one area. All right, well, we know where the ghost is. So do I even, oh yeah, <laughs> I did leave the uh, tier three light behind. Ooh, okay, look at these. I don't know if this is gonna, oh my God, you're just gonna give me full dirty waters. Now, I'm gonna take a photo for all these has dirty water. Now, hmm, that second one was an interaction. So three dirty water and then an interaction photo. I'm not gonna worry about any other interactions. So sanity is doing good. Can you do something? Can you throw something? Throw that soap. I think it's soap. Give us a sign, Kevin. He really likes the dirty water. Maybe I'll just go ahead and get some other stuff in here. Oh, oh my god, you are doing ghost events out here. Well, you're not an Oni. Maybe I should just stay away from that. Okay, in there, don't drain my sanity. I hate that though, because hmm, because this is like the adjacent room, and it and this is like, I guess this, this whole hallway is considered one room. So I gotta run all the way down here to turn the light back on. I guess that's just funny because technically, this is the adjacent room. It's just that the lights aren't all, you know, they're all the way down here. Now I could go back and get more equipment, but. I can talk and look for this, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. And I have a smudge, but I'm, I'm not thinking my sanity is going to drain here unless this is like another gin or something. Hey, and you know, it hasn't turned the breaker off, so maybe it is. Alright, I don't like that I'm running, but I, I got to get back there somehow. Okay, let's drop this. Not sure what setup I should have. Actually, I can just pick up everything. So instead, let me not do the spirit box first. Let me hit this and just scan this room. <laughs> we can cover this whole thing. Now, is the ghost orb going to be back in the shower? Oh, oh, see? Look at that. They do this on purpose, man. They definitely know to put these ghost orbs in like little corners like that. All right, see, that's twice now that I've looked in like a, I think the other one was on like Maple Lodge or one of the bathrooms on like the campsite maps. All right, let's not forget. Let's put it in properly. Ghost orbs. Now, I've been in the dark here. 
I love that though. Oh, and there it is coming out. Maybe I should ask. Oh, I think it just banged on something. Let me turn my light back on. I'm gonna leave that smudge at the door. Are you here? Right here. Yes. Okay. Let's let's ask it some questions. Where are you? Are you friendly? It does sound pretty good. I I, I like it. All right. How old are you? How old are you? Are you friendly? Well, let's do spirit box. Ooh, ooh could be yokai, which I don't want to be talking next to a yokai. Let me drop this now. Oh, this, this is the one, right? Can't even tell. Now, oh, EMF on that. Alright, I still have it on me. No EMF 5. So, st taking a step back. Mare, Yokai, or Onryo. Now, I don't know if it's turned on the light or not. More photo opportunities. Is that going to be any good, though? Yes, it is. Okay, well, I got lucky. The two evidence here was in two of them. Could be freezing. Could be writing. It could be dots. Alright, dots, UV, and freezing. Let's just go get those. I'm going to turn the light on in, in here. I was looking for the switch. I think the light switch for this room is right in here. So I'm going to turn this on. I hope that lights up all the way down there, but when, I'm going to have to do some hunt objectives. So when I smudge, I'm going to have to come... I'm going to have to come through here. Uh, okay. Hopefully there's a hiding spot. Uh, I'm running out of mouse pad. All right. I guess this is going to have to be good enough. I'm just going to hide behind this and hope. I got to scratch my nose again. Okay. Well, that tells us what sanity we're at. So... Oh, yeah, I don't need to mark that out. Well, we're going to bring in these other equipment. I don't know how long this is going to last. Man, look at this map, though. I really have spent too much time on house maps and stuff. I don't get to appreciate all the other locations. That's why I'm spending more time on the bigger maps on professional. I, I don't like how close we are. We're still pretty close to the ghost room here. That being said, though, this is not a ghost I'm too afraid of. Not at all. I don't... I didn't turn on the room's light, so it could be Mare. And there goes the light. Alright, I'm gonna run on... <clears throat> gotta turn those lights back on that I just turned on. Especially this one. I'm in here. Let's go bring that equipment back in, finally. Okay, so I was thinking about it. Since we still have to get to low sanity... I think I can, I'm going to, I'm going to try and get a photo of the ghost with the music box. I have a big open area. I think I can do it. So I'm going to need smudges. Hmm. I'm, this is not something I have to do, but I want to try it just because. And also, I, yeah, I need to get down to 25 anyway. So before I start taking pills, I'm, I'm not afraid of which, whatever ghost this is, because it's not going to be fast. So I'm going to go ahead and try and get these objectives done before I get the last evidence. What does that mean? I'm going to have to get another smudge in there. I don't even think I grabbed the lighter to begin with, damn it. I always forget the lighter for some reason. At least I didn't need it. So we're gonna bring in another smudge. I'm gonna have to take that music box with me. Maybe I could just bring in like this and we'll see if it's freezing. Oh, I, I, damn it, why am I so... I See, it's this lighter. I have a hard time remembering the amount of inventory. I picked up the lighter so I thought I only had three slots. So what's the other thing? Let's get a book in there because it could be writing, right? Yes. I think it could be a mirror because it never turned on its light that whole time. Instead, it was playing in the sinks. Alright, well this way I will get these other evidences in here. Mm -hmm. See, I I think I'm going to take my flashlight so I can see where I'm going. And I, I still have an easier time turning off that because you have to hold the button to turn off the other one. Oh my god, was that the breaker? I guess it was. Damn it, now I'm going to have to... I want that breaker on for this. So let me grab the music box. I need a camera, which is in the room. So I'll leave these two here and come back for them later. Now the light switches are on, but I gotta go run and turn the breaker back on. See, this is where big maps kind of become weird, but you know, this game almost is like kind of like a walking simulator in a way, especially when it first came out, when you couldn't even run and you had to walk like this. Like this was your max speed back in the day. So, in moments like this, you kind of just have to, you know, smell the roses, as they say. 
you know, just kind of enjoy walking around this creepy building and really remember where you are right now in the game. So to explain with this music box, what you're supposed to do, I've never really done this, but the ghost will start walking towards you visibly and it'll make its way to the music box once you're close enough to the ghost. So you need to place the music box down once it starts coming to you and then swap and take a photo. Now, my plan is to smudge, run away, maybe even have another smudge, but on this map, you can kind of just run away and not need a hiding spot if you can just keep breaking line of sight. This isn't going to be a super fast ghost. Now, did I turn off the breaker or turn it on? Because this... No, no, no. There we go. Okay. So sometimes I get that messed up. The ghost did turn off the light, all the lights because of the hunt. But I had turned on this main one. See? All right, I'm going to walk back through here. Turn these lights back on. And if the ghost turns them back off, I'm not going to do it again. But... I'm gonna try and have him. Oh my god, the ghost is hunting. Okay. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna worry about it. See, the problem is now is I'm losing sanity, and I'm not gonna have a lot of sanity to use the music box. I wonder if I can check. No, it's not below 25. If I don't hear the ghost, let me stand near this and just see when the hunt is over. Okay, well at least if the breaker's still on, I'll be able to hit these lights. Turn to open that. I'm gonna hit these lights on my way back. Damn it, I gotta turn the hall lights on again. See, I don't... Where are the other lights for this room? Like, there has to be another light switch. Oh, it's right here. Okay. See, I did have a... I did need to turn that one on. Okay, last time I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna turn these lights on. We're gonna try and hit this music box and see if it kills me. Now, I have a smudge on me, and I'd like to pick up that other one before I do this. But let me see. I gotta get over there. Okay, I'm not gonna use it right now. Let me... Ooh. That's not really what you're supposed to do. So, I'm gonna have a backup smudge. <laughs> Even with the light on, it's just that one, isn't it? I'm gonna throw this back up smudge here. I'm gonna try and smudge out here, and I'll be able to pick up that other one if I need it. <laughs> okay, screw the lights. We don't need them. Grabbing the camera. Oh. That's EMF-4. How's that an EMF-4? Maybe turn the breaker off? Okay. I'm probably... I might die here just because I don't have... Oh my god, that's how it turned it off. Why are you doing this? Because now you're going to be next to me when I do the music box. I need you to go back to your room. My... You're probably just going to hunt again. I'm going to try... I'm going to get back here more so for safety. Okay, see, my sanity's so low now. I'm, I'm going to actually go take sanity so I can do this properly. So at least I got the objective with this, but I'm sure I'm going to have to turn these lights on again at some point. Please let me out. Oh my god, it actually wasn't hunting. So, yeah, no reason to take all this back. Okay, so we need sanity to use the music box, but I don't want too much. So I'll take two pills. We still need to repel and prevent. So, I kind of forgot about the prevent. But the other things it could be was the dots and, uh... I guess the UV, what, could it? No, maybe it could not have been UV. No, okay. So we don't need UV. It was freezing, which we already have in there. So then I guess I'll just grab another smudge stick for safety. Okay, leaving the equipment here. The smudge. Maybe I'll leave a smudge here in case I need one. So what do we got? I'm going to have to play the music box. This is... Oof. That's what I'm going to have to do, is leave the smudge behind. Because I don't have the inventory to hold it. I mean, that's why... I mean, you could not... Let's try this. Let's put the light down. Well, that's a good idea. Let's put the light down and actually use it. So we'll use both like this. So my headlight's on. Jesus, the reflection. So what's going to happen is I'm... Oh, yes. I use that to put it down. God, I hate that. And then I'm going to swap. Okay. <sighs> okay. S do that. Swap. Ooh, okay. Can you tell I'm nervous? Okay, please be... I'm gonna listen. 
It's gonna start walking when I get close enough. Oh my god, okay, I still have my sp so yeah. Oh my god, my light. Okay, I'm gonna smudge back here. I'm gonna throw that at him. I can never tell. Okay. Um, he might see me break this corner. I have to- Ooh, I heard like a- Okay, let me get back to my other hiding spot. We did that pretty good. Uh, uh, that should be a three star. But man, that makes my heart race. So, I'm just kind of worried. There we go. So, uh, that's why I turned the light on, because I did not want him to be in the dark there. And I didn't know if I even could. But, uh, that's not too bad of a way of getting the ghost photo. It's terrifying, but- he, he, I, he gave me pretty just enough time. Like, if I was any slower, I probably would have been dead there. You're also still hunting because this is a cursed hunt now. Well, now we just need to prevent. Hmm. I don't know how much more I'm going to take, sanity-wise. Now I'm... Oh my god, he's actually really close. This is pretty much a hiding spot, though. Unless it comes in here looking. Whoa, where are you? How are you over there? I guess you were like all the way at the back of that. The interrogation or the visiting room. Alright. Stepping outside. Now I don't... I don't think we need to get hunted. Other than the fact, well, we gotta prevent a hunt. So, hmm. Alright, we're gonna want to get the other smudges back there. But the hmm, problem is... I have the inventory space. Uh... Maybe we'll take one sanity. That'll be 30. It'll put me just over, and maybe it'll... I want to get the evidence before we get hunted again. Alright, we already have all the evidences in there, so I'll drag them back. God, look at this. I hope the breaker is not off and it just got dark. So I'm going... Mm. See, well, ah, ah, ah. I, I don't have... I have enough sanity to not be in hunt range. God, the breaker. Okay. We don't have a smudge over there. I'm going to go with this. I'm really indecisive. I want to get at least one of the evidences over there, but let me get the crucifixes in there so I feel safe, and then I'll journey back with the other stuff. And it looks like we're going to be doing this in the dark. I'm actually going to leave my light right there, and it's going to keep serving this purpose. See, that's kind of a thing I want. Something I've thought about is, like, with the tripods, they could... Oh, so much for that. With the tripods, though, they could have spotlights. Oh man, this thing does not really cover the whole room. I'm just gonna do my- I'm gonna- that's- well, make sure it's not overlapping. There, I'm gonna hope that works. But, it would be cool if you could put, like, bigger spotlights kind of like this on the tripods. Like, imagine if I had set up a tripod here with the big light. This whole area would have light, even if the breaker went out. So, really, that's a cool idea, I think. And I'm basically already doing it by leaving that flashlight there. I'm not even- I'm not turning the breaker back on. I'm just going to hope that the smudge saves me. I'm going to hope that I walk in there, get the freezing, because that'll be an Onryo. Because <laughs> that'll be the easiest, we'll just to see if it's freezing. Oh, do I have... No, I don't, because I want to keep my smudge on me. But mm, We'll see how long it takes for it to write in the book, maybe. I do love this little idea I have here, though, using that light as a spotlight. Alright, this is where I need that tier 3 book, because I need even more room coverage. I mean, I know I could bring the other book in here. Part of me wants to smudge for activity, which I could. Oh, let me do this. Yes, thank you. Oh my god, it's just an Onryo. So, I could get two more photos. I don't really want to unless I... Oh, well, I guess I can. Oh, I guess I left the photos. Alright, I'm going to smudge... I think I have another smudge at the entrance, and even if I don't, maybe you'll do more activity. Maybe you'll write. Oh, did I put that here? There's no way I put that back here. I put that in the middle, didn't I? Okay, I didn't see if it threw the book. I did not put the book over here. If it threw the book and didn't close it, then it could be. Okay. Maybe I did put it over there. Why did I. Maybe I just put it back here with the. I thought I had this thing in the center of the room. It doesn't even matter, because guess what? We don't need it. But also, I'm sitting in the dark and you don't seem to be using the crucifix. Where are you? Are you here? Lift away. 
Are you friendly? Okay, the only thing left to do is just sit in the dark. I forgot, we got freezing now. We just found the sneaky ghost orbs and we got spirit box, so I'm not gonna mess with the Onreal with candles and I almost brought in a candle earlier. I think it's throwing more stuff over there. I just wanted to look and look at that ghost orb again. Now I heard you throw whatever that was. I'm hoping my sanity is just draining quick enough or the ghost is draining my sanity or something. I know I don't. I'm going to stay here a little bit longer. I'm not even going to worry about two more photos. I'm just going to see if the ghost will use the crucifixes. And actually, I don't even know if I have another smudge in here. I don't think I do. But I'm going to walk back and maybe the ghost will use that crucifix up. See, <laughs> it was throwing stuff in here from that hunt. Let me look and see... All right, there we go. It looks like we're on our way out of here if it doesn't hunt, which it shouldn't because it should be on cooldown. All right, what an interesting game on prison here. I'm very happy to have <laughs> done that music box photo because that is like another good way of getting a photo of the ghost with the uh, cursed items. And that one was one I really didn't know about. All right, so <laughs> the sun is rising here on prison. <laughs> I will see you all back on the stat screen. So yeah, on prison there was no chance of me finding the bone, but still, 1500, again, you don't have to worry too much about the bone, because one, it doesn't get multiplied, and again, you get a bigger mul or you get a bigger bonus for finding the ghost on a bigger map, so there's another 1500 for you. B block bottom left, alright, well, I guess if I looked in every little cell there, I would have found it. So if you're still here, thank you so much for watching, remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.